Hi and welcome to this Blueberry Markets video update with me John Kibler, Head Currency Analyst. In this video we're going to take a look at dollar cad has price has continued to push to the downside but is at a key support level right now so if we just look at this weekly time frame we'll just zoom in a little bit and then we just change this to a support line 128 is the key level here on dollar cad we can see recently price has tested this back in 2018 and the market rallied from this level through here price is now back down at this level now we're still in the process uh, or watching for those dollar selling opportunities because the dollar is typically weak until the end of uh, December so we're still expecting the market to drop a little bit but what we can see here is the potential for the market to bounce slightly so what we're looking for is essentially the retracement phase to then look for the trend continuation move so we can see here on the weekly very nice bit big bearish candlestick into the level going into the daily time frame we can see that the market has is in that impulse phase so we talked about this before where the market has that retracement move then we have that nice impulse phase and we're in that moment currently now what i like to do in these moments is look at the four hour trend because typically let me just get rid of these moving averages for a second typically when the daily impulses to the downside we get trend on the four hour time frame okay when we start seeing a retracement phase we get a higher high being formed we then get an impulse phase where the market four hour trend is down now look what's happening down here currently the market is starting to form a double bottom pattern okay so we can assume here that we're at a big level the market is impulsing to the downside and it has been for a while now we're at the key supporting point could this double bottom pattern in here show us that there is a potential for the dollar to retrace okay and especially dollar cad to potentially retrace backwards so there's two ways you can trade the market in these scenarios through here one way is looking at the impulse where do we expect the impulse to end and where would we expect the retracement to pull back to so if i was saying i want to be a short seller of dollar cad in line with trend i would likely look at this area around about 1.3 down to 1.2950 for short opportunities because i'd say that is previous structure low previous structure lows act as resistance when price comes back to it so we can look at it and say well if we're expecting the market to pull back to this area and we see the market break trend on the four hour time frame we could look for a short term long opportunity into this level before seeing the overall move down okay so keep an eye on dollar cad it's in potential retracement territory what we're going to do is set some alerts above this high which is around about 128.30 if the market breaks and closes above this area on the four hour time frame look for the market to change cycle look for the pullback look to trade long on some short-term opportunities in order to trade the trend opportunity up at 129.50 thanks for watching this video and i'll speak to you soon